WaveLab 9.5 brings numerous other enhancements and improvements, including a live spectrogram and touch bar integration to MacBook users with touch bar support. If your MacBook Pro includes the new touch bar, WaveLab 9.5 allows you to take full advantage of it. WaveLab 9.5 has a context-sensitive set of user actions that you'll see when launching the application. The default set can be customized to fit whatever configuration works best for you. And WaveLab automatically switches the context for the touch bar to the currently selected editor. So you can define your own touch bar setup for the audio editor, the audio montage, and the batch processor. Anyone running a high DPI display will appreciate the high display resolution offered by WaveLab 9.5. The WaveLab interface can now scale to accommodate even the sharpest displays. WaveLab 9.5 brings an all-new meter to the arsenal, the Live Spectrogram. The Live Spectrogram allows you to monitor the spectral information of your audio playback over time. It comes with numerous controls for how the meter scrolls and when it clears, and it can even adapt to the style of the current audio. You can even rotate the meter for a vertical display. Additional enhancements include the ability to change the meter input point to any position in the effect chain in the master section. You also now have the ability to bypass the master section without bypassing the playback processing, like room correction. And we've also added a bleep or sensor generator, just in case anyone uses a word like, or maybe a word like, during an interview. In version 9.5, you can now use Alt or Option and the space bar to start playback at the mouse position without clicking. And there are several other features and enhancements which are all the direct result of user requests.